This is Daughter of Christ. And it's that time of year again, the Islamic pagan season. They call it the Hajj. But just in case you're not familiar with it, I'll summarize it quickly for you. You know every day Muslims pray towards a rock? They go there and touch that rock. They run between two rocks. They throw small rocks at bigger rocks. They spend the day standing on rocks and they fight each other to kiss a rock. So you get it, it's a rocky time. In this video, we look at how these rocky pagan rituals have evolved over time. You see, the reason they kiss a black rock called a black stone is to get their sins forgiven. Now, for the sake of ease, convenience, and a lot of economic benefit of setting thousands of VR headsets, Saudi has now developed the ingenious idea of virtual black stone kissing and touching. You see, the history of in-person Hajj hasn't always been easy. Despite Allah's many promises of safety from disease, slaughter, bloodshed, war, and many other perils, the history of Hajj has seen a lot of, well, war, bloodshed, disease, infestation, and many other perils. Despite Saudi's glittering adverts of offering easy, comfortable, and efficient in-person Hajj, the reality is actually much different. So this Hajj season, we invite Muslims to come to a forgiveness that is not granted via stone, that you touch virtually, or risk your life to touch under a stampede, but to come to the cornerstone, the ever alive Jesus Christ, who can touch you with a healing, forgiving hand anywhere you are in the world without your need to travel anywhere for him.